Hi, welcome to another Science at Home. Today we're going to be looking at magnetism. So what you're going to need for this are a few different magnets that you can grab from your fridge, or if you've got magnets at home for different toys or things, those will work. And then you're going to want a selection of magnetic objects that vary in size and weight. Uh, what I'm going to do is I've got some different types of paper clips, different sizes, so that's what I'm going to end up using. And what we're going to end up doing is testing the strength of our magnets. Now, around every magnet, there's something called a magnetic field. Now, we can't see it, but it extends out from that magnet a certain distance. So, depending on the size of the magnet or what material it's made out of, that magnetic field might extend more and would give your magnet more strength. So, I pulled out a random selection of some of our fridge magnets and we're going to test them out. Now, when you're doing the testing, the important thing to remember is that you want to make sure it's consistent. So I'm going to pick uh, these three paper clips to be my starters. If I need more, I'll grab more from my pile, but each magnet I'm going to test with those same ones so I can compare them um, exactly the same. I'm going to start with the large paper clip on all of them. And we'll see that's going to hold it really nicely on this magnet. Then I'm going to go to my other paper clip, my other... And you can see, so I'm holding two paper clips up with this magnet, so it's pretty strong. That's pretty on there, good. Try touching the third to it. There's a little attraction, but it's not going to quite stick to it. So two, let me try. So I'm going to get two paper clips on this one, a big one and a smaller one. Let me take another fridge magnet we have. This one's a little bit smaller. Let's see how this one does. My big paper clip, that's going to hang on there. And then my other one. Ooh. I can feel it trying to grab, but I don't think it's going to be able to stay on there. So, with my testing, we figured out that this magnet is going to be stronger than this magnet. And so you can do that with all your different magnets and see if you can figure out which of yours is the strongest. And then send us a photo of your best magnet. Hopefully you enjoyed that, and I'll see you for the next time.